dear viewers i come with a new tutorial and this tutorial is about how to move files uh, or folders from server to dropbox and dropbox to server it's quite easy so i will show it in the virtual uh, box uh, with my centos so uh, if this is the same thing like if you work to work with your uh, hosting uh, site and uh, this is uh, how we can do that first download and make uh, this is script executable uh, so first uh, let's enter our uh, virtual box i am already in there so make a uh, folder called dropbox make d yes dropbox yes sorry command is wrong make d yes this is a uh, if you check this uh, there is a folder called dropbox is created so we will enter on it robots so next thing is we will copy this command copy and paste it like this on yes this is the command here so we just copy it and uh, paste it on our terminal yes so it is downloading so you clear our skin now next part is uh, we have to configure it uh, so see the file name dropbox uploader.sh it is already downloaded so next part is configure it so before configure it let's run the script sorry and if you run, uh, try to run the script it will show you that uh, permission denied because we don't uh, make it executable let's make it executable so we will make it executable with this command csmod plus x drop up, uh, dropbox uploader dot so let's make it executable yes now if you run this uh, i mean configuration dot slash dropbox dot ss then it will show you it is asked for access token let's make our access token though i already make a uh, token here uh, i mean here uh, so i will delete it first and make a new one to show you so i will click create app then dropbox api then full dropbox executable and put my uh, name like two and i will click create so if you check this uh, we have nothing to do on top uh, we just need this one generate access tokens so we just click on it and it will create a access token for us we so just copy it and then we will put it on our this here test yes so next it will ask that that access token is right or not then it i will click yes it is right so then configuration has saved now it will show up a message if you check this there is a message called yes this is connected with our dropbox so next uh, let's uh, try with our comments uh, how can we um, run this comments first we will uh, collect our dropbox info so we will run this comment so let's run it first copy it let's clear it now it's cleared and uh, then if you if you check this uh, it shows up uh, my uh, info here uh, with the dropbox and my email and country so let's clear it here Now, if I check with uh, the list of files uh, uh, from my Dropbox folders and files, we, we will run this command. So let's try it. Yes. So it's listing your group, uh, folders and files. If you check this. So next uh, next part is uh, let's go for next slide. 
and uh, we'll try to upload a, a specific file from a uh, I mean a folder localhost this is the uh, local folder if you check this this is the local folder and this is the Dropbox folder so uh, before Dropbox folder I mean uh, uh, to send this file we will create a uh, I mean I mean folder in Dropbox and uh, that will be under uh, documents if you check this I am uh, inside documents home documents and I will create a folder inside it so let's create it so create a folder so create a folder you just run this command so I'll create it yes it's a it's creating a directory in uh, documents if you check this it's already created so let's uh, move a file from our local directory to here I mean local server to here so far this is the code here I just copy it so and I will paste it here for better understand so it shows that uh, we are in home in Mahmood and uh, documents and new dot text and if we check this uh, one minute this is the documents folder and uh, then I will create a, a file here I mean uh, this one so I will let's enter from our uh, let's open another terminal that will be fine for me cd doc documents nano new dot text hi dropbox so we have a file now and uh, if you check this uh, open with jedit you will see it, this is a file called hi dropbox so uh, we have a file now so let's move it to our dropbox and if we check our dropbox this is empty now this is totally empty so we will move our file from our local server i mean our server to here so we will this command let's check with it yes this is our chrome, chrome box uh, i mean dropbox so let's run it yes wait for a few seconds it depends on your internet speed so it shows that yes it's done let's check it yes it comes with our uh, into our uh, dropbox folder so it is working so let's go for uh, our next uh, thing uh, i mean uh, to uh, upload a specific file we uh, we able to do that and uh, next one is to upload a, a specific directory so I those though I show you uh, to delete a folder with all contents you can easily delete it uh, I mean uh, if you wish to delete uh, the Dropbox test folder let's uh, we can try with it too uh, but before that uh, try to upload um, full folder inside uh, Dropbox uh, let's do it you can try it uh, of your own and uh, I will show you now um, how to delete a folder with all its contents so now we you see there is some contents uh, in our dropbox folder uh, we already have and uh, uh, i mean this is the dropbox folder and there is some contents here so we will uh, delete it here uh, from our command prompt uh, the full content so just run this command and uh, this is uh, delete your documents from here so the folder test has been deleted you see there is a command prompt here so this is working fine and uh, nicely and uh, this is the command if you wish to download any remote file from dropbox and uh, how can you download this uh, so first uh, you run this command and uh, then you will put your dropbox folder name i mean if which folder you wish to download if it's a root folder then uh, documents will not be there if it will be a folder under documents then you, you will put like uh, url like this and uh, then where you wish to download you will put your full server address here I mean if you wish to download a file a single file then you will put it name and name can be same or different it depends on you but uh, extension will be same 
and to download the an entire remote folder from Dropbox to local folder uh, to total um, download full folder you just uh, have to follow same rules just uh, not put the uh, file name uh, you just put the folder name and then you will give the your uh, I mean address uh, local home address where you wish to download uh, if you wish to un uh, install it I mean uh, if you wish to install this uh, Dropbox uploader then you will run this command uh, dropbox uploader dot ss dot uh, i mean ss uh, unleak and uh, remove dropbox directory for from your local folder i mean not server i mean if you if it is set up on server then click remove it from server for now it is on uh, my directory so i will show this last command how can you in uninstall it you need it always for security so you just go for your command line and just run it and click on it and just click yes so it is uh, now removed uh, from your dropbox account and unlink, unlink this script and just then you just remove this folder where i am uploaded i mean i mean downloaded my script uh, that's all actually this is the last part of our uh, this tutorial thanks for watching